Okay, this is my Bridgeport uh, J head milling machine. Uh, the motor died. It's a J uh, head motor, and uh, it's a special frame motor, uh, hard to find. Um, I had it estimated like $1,200 to get repaired, and they're pretty expensive to find online if you can find them. But uh, they also sell a C, C head or a C face motor adapter kit, but they're about 500 bucks, and it's kind of tough to make one uh, when you don't have a milling machine that. Uh, that'll work. So anyhow, I'm trying to kind of hillbilly this thing here. Uh, this is a DC permanent magnet motor, uh, two horsepower motor, uh, out of a treadmill. Uh, actually, it's out of that treadmill. And uh, this is the old, some of the old motor bits and stuff that are broken and burned up that I'm not going to be using anymore. But uh, anyhow, so trying to get this thing back together. Uh, like I said, it's a DC motor. On the inside, I found a uh, alternator pulley off of a small block Chevrolet that happened to fit up decent. It's probably not permanent, but I just wanted to see if this thing would work or not. My, the idea would work. Uh, just got it clamped up there. Uh, this is the DC uh, motor controller. I think they call it a, a PR or PWR. I'm not sure. But uh, anyhow, it's just the controller for the motor. Over here, I've got a potentiometer and a momentary switch that I'm, I've just kind of got hot wired for right now, but it does work when you switch it on and off. I got a hot wire to be on right now. So it'll do that. Uh, the cool thing is it plugs into 110 volt AC. So pretty handy for the home user. And with the potentiometer and the DC setup, I get variable speed, which is, I think it'll end up being kind of nice. But so I can run it real slow, even at a, at a slow pace with the small motor I can't I can't hardly stop it I can't do anything with it it just runs uh, and I can run it up So I think that I think that the uh, DC motor runs up to 5,000 over 5,000 RPM. The factory motor ran up to I think 1,750. So, uh, but it's cool. I got variable speed. Uh, I don't know how to finish mounting it just yet, or how it's going to look when I'm done. But uh, I'm looking forward to getting it done so I can have a milling machine back again. Uh, anyhow, I think it's kind of neat, and I think it should be. I think it should work.